You know, for me, when I'm at home relaxing after a tough day at the studio, there's nothing I enjoy more than sitting on my deck, looking out at the hills, and enjoying a good cup of cappuccino. And it's easy to make, you know. I have this wonderful Avanti cappuccino maker that's great for making cappuccino and espresso and other flavored hot coffee drinks. Let me make you a cup. You've all seen me on those coffee maker commercials, and you know I love a good cup of cappuccino. Well, you just bought yourself an Avanti coffee maker. You must love a good cappuccino, too. We put together a short demonstration tape to show you just how easy it is to make good European-style cappuccino in your own home. Let's watch. Congratulations on the purchase of your new Avanti minibar. This videotape is designed to help you take the maximum advantage of your coffee maker. Please review it carefully, and you'll soon be making great cups of coffee. The Avanti Mini Bar comes supplied with a filter basket, a filter, a coffee measuring scoop, and a tamping tool. You supply some finely ground coffee and a pitcher of milk or cream, and you're ready to make a great cup of cappuccino. Place the filter in the filter basket, then fill it with a scoop of coffee. Tamp the coffee down and place the filter basket in the coffee maker. Make sure the two ridges of the filter basket line up with the notches on the coffee maker. Bring the basket in at an angle and twist right to secure it at the center. Next, fill the water canister at the back until it's almost full. Place the lid on the canister to seal the vacuum. The button marked with an O turns the coffee maker on and off. When you press this button, the red light illuminates as well as the yellow light, which represents the heating element. When the yellow light goes out, the water is hot enough to make coffee. Your coffee maker will brew two cups of espresso at a time. Place the cups under the two spigots of the filter basket. Press the button marked with a coffee cup to begin brewing. The cups as the water level in the canister drops. Turn the coffee button off when the cups are almost full. Your espresso is now brewed. You're ready to steam the milk for cappuccino. Press and hold the steam button until the yellow light goes out. Release the button and place a pitcher of cold milk or cream under the steam spigot. Turn the steam knob on. Rotate the pitcher slightly to make sure the milk is evenly heated. Turn the steam knob off and pour the heated milk into your brewed espresso. Enjoy! Now wasn't that easy? Now go make yourself a cup, and salute.